thank you so much for that awesome introduction and thank you so much for welcoming everybody always really nice to have somebody here to make sure the door is open um every single tuesday you guys welcome 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 to tuesday tuesday is like my favorite day of the entire week because i get to spend a whole entire hour um well sometimes less but i get to spend time with the raw choices organization um and of course everyone else who decides to tune in um so that we can talk we can train we can get some things out we can refill um our vehicles so that we can move forward in the next seven days full of excitement full of determination full of enthusiasm and just ready to go so that we can reach those goals that we have set in place um for ourselves you guys i am excited here do me a favor will you guys do me a quick favor will everybody do me a favor yes 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 in the chat box will you guys do me a favor i want us to do something i want to show you guys how powerful <clears throat> how powerful doing things in numbers are i want to show you guys what a team can do that one person cannot will you guys do me a favor will you guys work with me for just a second this is what i want to do there are 74 of us on this line and i want to do a little experiment okay i want to do a little experiment because there's power in numbers i want everybody to take a second take a minute hop on your phone hop on your your text message hop in your inbox you guys take one minute and say i'm on the raw choices training call hop on here now you're missing out and put on there the meeting id do me that favor you guys take a second hop on there do that really quickly <clears throat> and let's see what happens let's see if we can double this number it was at 74 let's see if we can get 150 um just from one um shout out on facebook on instagram direct text messages work the best so send it out if you see somebody that's not in the chat box is not on here go ahead send a quick message let them know we're about to get some training from tony ward hop on the raw choices collaboration training call right now wouldn't want you to miss out with this good stuff okay so let's see let's take a second i'm gonna i'm gonna take a minute myself i'm gonna take somebody too and see if i can get somebody on here you guys i don't want you to ever think that is too late i don't want you to ever think oh my goodness oh they'll remember oh you know what they already know they might be waiting for that call so many times i talk to people after the call is over and i tell them how wonderful the call was all the stuff we learned all the people that were on the call and then they say oh shoot i forgot oh wow is it tuesday oh man i wish i could have had a reminder i purposely did not send an email out today because i wanted to show you guys how much power you actually have um when you just send out when you're that accountability partner when you're somebody that somebody else can count on you know a lot of times we will and we can fall short in our businesses in our lives with our families you know things happen but it's really nice to have somebody who is watching out for you so that if in fact you do fall short they can pick you up at a little extra piece so that you can then pick back up and get it together okay it's growing a little bit you guys are sending out a couple of messages i see people are hopping on so let's see how good we can do before this call is over now deidre without even knowing it gave you the best introduction to what we're going to talk about today okay but before we do that while we're waiting for some more people to hop on i want to give you guys the announcements because there are two travel parties actually that i want to talk to you guys about that's happening now this first travel party you guys if you look on the screen you can see this is happening every single monday now this is what has success leaves clues okay i did a travel party for one of our new agents um and on sunday i think she had a travel party at her house she invited people over super cool i zoomed in um she had three guests now she has two new travel agents <laughs> super cool travel parties work get your guests to your house yes 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 virtual parties are good okay virtual parties are fabulous but it's just something about that human touch it's something about the interaction it's something about letting them be there face to face so that you're actually able to get that information over to them even if you guys are watching 
a virtual travel party together. Invite some people over, have them over. Um, and then they can talk to the leadership over, you know, the the computer, over the, the Zoom, because she actually had her computer attached to uh, the television, so they were able to see up front, live and, per, you know, close them up front. So it was like, you know, I was there with them. Um, but then it gives them that extra, you know, so they're there with people. They're not at home by themselves, um, but it's still a virtual travel party. So every single Monday in my home, um, in the Bay Area, if you are anywhere near Discovery Bay, when I say anywhere near, I mean if you're even an hour away, come on down, um, congregate with the other travel agents, bring your friends, bring your guests, 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 guests. I'm going to make sure we laugh, we talk, we talk about travel, we eat. It's going to be a good time every single Monday. Now, here's the cool part. Guess what's happening this upcoming Monday? This is why I asked Deidre to put this up here, because next Monday, Santa Claus is coming to town, okay? I repeat, Santa Claus is coming to town. What does that mean? I'm gonna let the people who know what I'm talking about hop in the chat box and tell me. Who's Santa Claus, you guys? Who is our Evolution Travel Santa Claus? Who is it? Santa Claus will be in Discovery Bay next Monday. Super excited to have our very own Ron Archer coming to our travel party at my home next Monday. So super cool, you guys. Let's pack out the house. Let's make sure we bring our guests. Every single person, come on out. Let's greet him with open arms and let him understand what the Bay Area can do um, when we put our minds to it. So bring all the guests. I'm assuming at least 20 guests will be in the house, and I know it'll be standing room only. So make sure you get there early because it's going to be a beautiful sunset. Come on out. Sit on the water. We'll have our travel party. We'll talk business. We'll talk fun. We'll talk travel. And we'll make sure that everybody gets to meet our one and only Santa Claus because Santa Claus is coming to town. There is also another travel party. Um, I hope Deja can pop this one up because you guys know Deja works magic. She is magical, okay? Um, it's coming in uh, Detroit. And I think it's on Thursday. If I'm not mistaken, it's this Thursday. There's going to be a travel party in the Detroit area with um, Fred Howe, Lynn Huddleston, Deidre Driscoll, and Terrera um, Boudreaux. There'll be a travel party this Thursday. So make sure you check out um, those uh, Facebook posts because they've been posting it everywhere. I'll also have it on our Evo schedule um, email website tonight as well. And everybody who's on there will get an email with the information. So make sure you guys, if you're anywhere in an area where there's a travel party, get there as fast as possible and, you know, become familiar with the people who are giving the travel parties. Lend a helping hand. Make yourself a regular. You know, you can be a regular at a bar. <laughs> you can also be a regular at a travel party. Make sure you are there because every single week something new is shared, especially with the transition that our company is going through right now. There's going to be so much information sprinkled. Here we go. Thank you so much, Deidre. There's going to be so much information sprinkled on you at every single travel party. You don't want to miss it. You can come to the travel party here um, in Detroit. The address is on here. Um, please take notes. That will be sent out to you guys too today. Everybody who's on the Evo, Evo, uh, Evo schedule.info, everybody will get this flyer tonight as well as the one. So there's also a virtual travel party every single day at 6 o'clock. Um, well, every day except for Sunday and Tuesday, I will be doing my Q&A um, on, online. So invite your guests. I need the agents there too. Let's make sure that Q&A, you guys, has a 99% close rate. So you want to make sure you get your guests on there too. This is the thing. It's informal. You guys, you know me, right? You know me. I'm Tony Ward. I'm raw and uncut. I like to just give it to you the way it is. Um, straight, no chaser. Uh, make sure they get all the questions answered. I want to make sure everybody gets all the information they have. I want to make sure that they, I speak to all their concerns so that they can, on the spot, make an educated decision about joining our family here at Evolution Travel. I love Evolution. I love what it's done to my life. I love what it's doing to the lives around me. And I want to make sure that I let them know that whatever it is it can do for their lives, I want them to understand and know that, okay? So like I was saying, Deja's introduction was key. 
because she was talking about success. She was talking about, you know, success in your business. She was talking about success in your lives, success with your family, success in all different kind of ways. And everybody has their own definition of success, right? Do me a favor, hop in the chat box and like five or six words, tell me what success means to you. What is success in your in your eyes? What success? Does success mean time freedom? Does success mean financial freedom? Does success mean getting to a certain level? Does success mean doing what you want, when you want, with who you want, how you want? What does success mean to you? Now, the whole point of that is when you are thinking about success and when you're thinking about your business, you have to also understand that your definition is the only definition that matters. My definition of success is nothing as compared to your definition of success because it's what matters to you. Success is such a broad range. It's like speaking in different languages when you're talking about different people's um, definitions of success. And I want you guys to understand that. Take a second, write it down. What is success to me? Write that question down. I want you guys to actually think about what is success to me? And then I want you to think about how can I obtain that level of success with evolution travel. Work backwards. I always want you guys to work backwards, know what you want, and then figure out how to get it. If you know what you want, you can definitely figure out how to get it. Put that post on your Facebook. What is success to you? Just put it out there. Put that question on your Facebook. What is success to you? Let people answer that question. And then you, as be an evil doctor for a minute, Figure out how you can prescribe evolution to meet that success. If success to you means I'm able to travel two times a year with unlimited, you know, time frames. I don't have to worry about calling in sick to work or using my vacation time or whatever. If that's success to you, then how can evolution travel? How can your business give you that success? If success to you means um, being able to spend more time with your family, you know, not working so much overtime, maybe meeting, um, meeting with, with your kids and your family, your husband, your wife, and spending more family time. Maybe that's your idea of success. How can evolution travel help you to obtain that level of success? Maybe for you, success is having an extra $10,000 in the bank, you know, stash money. You know, maybe success can be all different kinds of things. Maybe success is just proving them wrong. Maybe success is just being able to do what you want to do. How can evolution travel get you to that level of success? That's what you need to understand. That's what you need to know. Because a lot of times, success, my level of success might not be the same as somebody else's. Maybe I want to be able to make $100,000 a month. That's right now, that's my level of success. I, once I'm making $100,000 a month, I'll feel like, okay, I've done it. I've achieved the level of success I want to achieve, right? But what if somebody else's level of success is, I want to be able to take myself and my fiance on a cruise. So we're going to have to do different things. That person who wants to go on a cruise with their fiance might just need to do a training. Okay, so since that's my level of success, I know my business is successful because I get to go on this cruise, what do I have to do to get there? Okay, so all I need to do is actually do a princess training, right? Do a carnival training, right? Do a um, Norwegian training and get me a free cruise. Maybe that's what I need to do. Or maybe I can use the 499, because remember, we can go on a cruise for 499 with MSC and Virgin, right? And that might be how I obtain that level of success. So it's really important for you guys to really outline what success means to you so that you're able to identify what you need to do to meet that level of success. Maybe, maybe you want a new car and you want Evolution Travel to pay that car note for you every single month. If I could just get my car note paid using my Evolution Travel business, that would be my level of success. So that's what I want you guys to do. If you want to share it and put it in the chat box, that's super cool. Hop in the chat box, put it in there. 
let us know what your level of success. It could also be a goal. Your level of success can also be um, defined as a goal too, however you want to word it. But right, and those levels of success will change. Once I hit that hundred thousand dollars, you guys, I'll be happy for a little bit, but I'm gonna go to two hundred thousand, right? And then I'm gonna go to three hundred thousand. So your levels change as you grow and evolve. So will your outlook on life. So will your outlook on your business. So will your outlook on everything. It's going to evolve. Think about it. For those of you who have teams, listen. For those of you who have teams right now, whether it's three people, six people, a hundred people, a thousand people, for those of you who have teams, remember when you first got started and it was only you? Do you remember when you opened up your back office and it said one and zero downline? Do you remember that? It just said one back there. Remember? I remember when it was just me, a team of one. And guess what? At that moment, I had to figure out, okay, how do I get this to change? How do I make this number change? What can I do? Is this going to help me? Remember that. If you go into your back office right now today and look at what it says, imagine in your mind what you want it to say. I would definitely challenge all of you to print out your back office. Print out that page. Just print it out. And no matter what it says right now, I want you to take a permanent marker and I want you to make it say what you want it to say. After you have made your back office say what you want it to say, put it on your wall. Look at it. Imagine it. Make sure you understand that you are visualizing your future. That is the level of success you are working towards. If you are booking travel and your level of success is an Ayatan card. Do me a favor. Go to Google. This is what I want you to do. Go to Google and then just search Ayatan card. All these Ayatan card pictures are going to pop up. Print one out and put your picture on the Ayatan card. Put it on there. Put it on the wall. Okay? If you want your $100,000 ring, go to your back office. Print out your balance history sheet. And right in there, $100,000. Look at it. Visualize it. This is your level of success. The one thing about success, the one thing about anything you have to do, anything that you want to accomplish, is you need to be able to visualize it, see it, understand it, and know that it's obtainable to you on every single level possible. So, what is your level of success? You guys, think about that wholeheartedly because I promise you, if you see it, you can achieve it. You got to see it, you got to believe it, and then you'll be able to achieve it. But you have to actually believe it. If you believe that it's hard to run your business, guess what? It's hard to run your business. If you believe that you have no time for your business, well, guess what? You have no time for your business. If you believe that it's easy, agents will flock to you, people will book travel with you, everything that you do, put your hands on, will be successful, guess what? It will happen, okay? So I need you guys to be in the realm of positivity. I need you guys to make sure you understand that you have the power within yourself to achieve any level of success that you believe you can possibly achieve. That is important. The main key word in that, you guys, is believe that you can achieve. I believe in my heart of hearts that every single person on this line can achieve any level of success they want to achieve with evolution travel. And the reason, you guys, I believe that is because I have done it myself. The reason I believe it is because just like every single person on this line, I started with one agent, and that one agent was me. That is the most powerful thing you can possibly do is stay true to yourself. Make sure your business is where it's supposed to be. Make sure your business is doing what it's supposed to do. You can never depend on any single person in your business to make a change. You are responsible for everything that happens in that back office, you guys. So I want you guys to understand not only 
that is achievable. But I want you to understand your power behind what happens, how those numbers change, right? Um, let's go back to when we were kids, okay? And we got that first piggy bank, right? Your parents gave you that piggy bank for some of us, for most of us, it was empty. Think about the first time you put one thing in that bank and you heard the cling, and it's like, okay, now there's something in there until all of a sudden, I can't fit anything else in my piggy bank because you were constantly filling it up. You were constantly thinking, okay, I want to do this. You were constantly understanding that this piggy bank can be full. I can do this. That was your level of success. Your level of success was to make sure your bank was full. Your level of success right now is to make sure your life is full. Make sure your business is full of travel. Make sure your business is full of success. Make sure your business is full of everything and anything you want to fill it with. If you want your business to be full of negativity, guess what? It starts with you. If you want your business to be full of positively, positivity, guess what? It starts with you. So it's really important for you to pour into your business whatever it is you want it to be full of. You guys, you can do this. Um, success is inevitable if you do not give up. You are going to succeed in any way possible if you do not give up. The only way here, and I know you guys hear this all the time. You're probably tired of hearing it, but you're going to hear it one more time. The only way you will not succeed in this business is if you decide to quit. If you stop paying that bill, if you stop marketing your, your business, if you stop hopping on your training calls, if you stop having a positive outlook, then of course, you're not going to get what you want to get out of the business because you have started putting all of the negativity in your business and it's just going to go backwards. So I definitely... I'm so happy that you guys hop on here every single Tuesday. That's why it doesn't matter where I'm at. It doesn't matter what I'm doing. If I'm breathing, if I'm breathing and I'm able to get some kind of connection, I'm going to make sure I pour into you guys as much as possible. I can guarantee that for you because I know we all need these things. You know, we um, there was about 20 of us this weekend. Kudos to all the people who... Um, came out this weekend, or about 20 of us, who did a workshop. This workshop was phenomenal. The lady who did the workshop for us not only works with Oprah, she works with TV Jakes. She's doing all kinds of things, okay? And this workshop would normally cost $10,000. $10,000 workshop we did on Saturday. But because we were so passionate about our business and because, you know, we went in there, we did you know, every single thing we did, we believe that we can talk to her. We believe that she can give us all the things that we needed. We actually got it at an affordable price and was able to participate in something wonderful. You guys have to make sure that you are filling yourself up with everything and anything you can possibly um, use for you to grow in your business, within your business, because you can make it happen. You can make it possible, but you have to be feeding yourself. The same way you feed yourself food every day is the exact same way you need to be feeding yourself things about your business, because your body needs nourishment, just like your mind needs nourishment. So make sure you are doing that for yourself, because it is so important to give yourself that. It's kind of like giving yourself vitamins, like your Tuesday call is kind of like your vitamin, right? You're already happy. You're already, you know, going through the motions with evolution travel. You're already doing the stuff you need to do. And Tuesday, you get your vitamin boost. This is your vitamin boost. So make sure you use this vitamin boost. Make sure you pass your vitamin boost along to the other people in your team. Make sure you are taking your vitamins every single Tuesday. Don't miss out because you never know what's going to happen. You never know what we're going to talk about. You never know who's going to be here. You never know what kind of training is going to be. You just have to make sure that you are here to receive it so that you can um, embrace it, you can digest it, and you can use it however you need to use it um, in your life. You know, when you get a multivitamin, that's what we're going to call it. We're going to call it the multivitamin. So when you get a multivitamin, depending on what your body has a deficiency, will determine how much, you know, different parts of the vitamin are going to go to different places, right? I might need vitamin D. Well, somebody else might need vitamin A. Or somebody else might need vitamin, you know, B12 or whatever. But whatever it is in that vitamin that you need for your body, 
is going to go into your body. The same way with this call. Whatever we say on these calls, on these trainings, on all the stuff we have to offer for you guys, whatever is there for us, whatever part you need is going to give you the fuel that you need to run your vehicle for the rest of that week. So I just want to make sure you guys understand and you put down, this is your homework. You know I got to give homework. This is your homework. I want you guys to go into your back office. Make sure you print out, okay, print out your back office. And I want you to take a permanent marker. And the reason why I say permanent marker is because I need this to be stuck in stone. I need you guys to understand that this is stuck in stone. Take that marker and put on there exactly what you want your perm your your back office to look like. If you want your back office to say platinum, write platinum on there. If you want your back office to say you have 2,000 agents, put that on there. If you want your back office to say, you know, whatever it is you want it to say, put it on there and put it somewhere that you're going to put it by your bed. I know when I used to be um, talking to my mentor from my first mentor, they told us to take some money and put it on the ceiling of our house. Uh oh, somebody's not, um, not muted. Make sure you guys mute your phones, please. Um, put it on the ceilings of your house so that every time you wake up, you see the money, you know? Um, they had all kind of things that you can do to make sure you were able to, um, they're able to um, see, you know, your goal so that you can stay focused on your goal on a regular daily basis. So make sure you put that if it's in the bathroom, if it's by your bed, wherever it is. Make sure you have it somewhere so that you're able to uh, view it, visualize it, and you're able to uh, digest it on a daily basis. You have to look at your goals. You have to look at your success rate. You have to look at your vision every single day, okay? So make sure you do that. It looks like um, Choices Legacies, Fred Howe has actually joined us this evening. Congratulations, you made it to the call. I know that he's been working some weird hours. So let's welcome him to our call this evening. Hey, Fred, can you hear me? Yeah, Tony, can you hear me clearly? I can absolutely hear you. Perfect, perfect. I was just sitting up here listening to your training, and, uh, you know, it, it definitely hit home because we, we lived that experience. And, you know, one quote that you could actually uh, agree upon that we were raised on is just that our mindset was already platinum. We just wanted to make sure our back office is caught up with it. Uh, I remember we used to talk about that all the time. It's like, you know, I'm already platinum, I'm already platinum, and then we have to make sure to, you know, that our back offices match that. So we just had to, you know, just move different. And, you know, I put a post in the Evolution page. If you guys can go find it, somebody should go on there and just uh, say something. I know you guys probably seen it, but I, I put on there and I said specifically, you know, what are the words that platinum don't use? Uh, you know, some of the things like I can't and I won't and uh, I don't know and things like that are, are, the, are the key indicators that you guys aren't thinking big enough. And just listening to what Tony has been just, you know, pretty much uh, drilling into your mindset, guys, is just the simple fact that um, you are what you believe. And, you know, that has more control over anything physical uh, you could possibly think of when you think about who's not doing what for your business or who's not showing up and showing out. Um, but if you mentally believe, you know, you are great and you're platinum, and uh, it'll definitely be something that comes to pass because you already have the mindset for it. Uh, I remember when we were going through the ranks when we first got started and we took that trip to Hawaii, and, excuse me, we was all talking about, uh, you know, who, who, what ranks we're going to go through. And I remember when Tony um, and Tony Ward literally went through every single rank so fast, I don't even believe she even recognized the rank she was sitting at. And then we all just followed suit when we actually did that. So we just actually went step by step and, uh, you know, pushed through the ranks and, um, you know, hit silver and then hit gold. And then when we got to platinum, you know, how she was just explaining to you guys that, um, you know, once you get a goal, you know, even if that's your form of success, um, as she just spoke about the piggy bank situation, guys, it gets full. You got two options. You either, you know, unload that into something else like another institution or another mind or another soul, and then you rebuild it, or you get a bigger piggy bank, guys. And what that means is that your goals tend to change as your lifestyle changes. Uh, you know, when we got to a certain level, you know, when we look at it, like she just mentioned, guys, you get, you know, $100,000 a month is her goal. But I know for a simple fact, once she reaches that goal, 200000 is the next mark. 
uh, when we actually got to two-star, you know, and, and got to that point, it was just, you know, laser beam focused for us to get to three-star. Now, once we achieve that goal, the key rate in your mind, you have to realize is just that if I can do this, I can do that. And we say that when we do our presentations, guys. If you can add three people to the organization, you can do six. If you can add six, guys, you can do nine. And if you can do nine, guys, you can go gold. Getting to platinum is only duplicating and, and, and multiplying the system that you did to get to executive. It's really that simple. And our mindset has been tweaked to the point where we realize that it's possible. Um, you know, huge shout-out to all the new platinums. There's a big shout-out to Nikki and Charles Lee from going from the top of the total pole to the bottom of the total pole, guys, all the way back up to the tip top, double platinums, triple gold, on their way to two-star platinum, guys. They just did what the, you know, what the masses wouldn't do, guys, and they just never gave up, and they just kept going towards their determination. And so that lit a fire under this whole entire organization. And if I, uh, I don't know if Tony mentioned it, to you not, mentioned it to you guys or not, but David McCovey and the lead eight and the founders council guys have been in the lab and we're definitely focused on making this company even better um, than what it than what it is. Uh, we like to make up words because you know we own our own business, but we like to say it could get greater, greater, or better, or anything we like to say because we have we're, we're confident that we're going to change the world, guys. We're going to change the situation that we're in. We're going to change the dynamics of travel. We're going to change the dynamics of being in the business. And uh, you, you know, huge motivational shout out to all the leadership that definitely believe and what we're absolutely doing. So if you guys take very, very good notice that, you know, the training that Tony just gave you guys, um, and just the, the words of the mentors and the, and the leadership that's, you know, guiding you guys in the right direction, you are literally, if you get anything a part of your homework, guys, write that in your homework for Ms. Uh, Tony Ward. If you believe it, you can achieve it, guys. It's really, really simple. And that's where we get our platinum mindset from, and that's how we've been able to be successful. And that's why we believe in every single one of you guys who are totally capable, totally possible to achieve those type of ranks um, and, and be a part of the elite squad, guys. And, uh, you know, Tony, we, I was just talking to David earlier uh, about, you know, trying to figure out if we can get a leadership uh, trip together, not only just Founders Council and things like that, but people who have made it to the gold and above to just appreciate them because we have so many new goals in the business right now. I would love to just shake their hands and say congratulations because they're on absolute fire. So I just really appreciate everybody really building and pushing toward uh, greatness with this business. Uh, I, I remember the day we meet Tony and Derek and Isla and James Brown Jr. and a few other, uh, you know, Elite Eight members. We were sitting down and talking about uh, how people are just so short-minded with thinking about what they're going to do with the business tomorrow. But Tony can agree, just like any other leader in this organization can, be, can agree from the very beginning. We literally were looking 10 years down the line. We were already plotting on where we were going to be. We were telling David McCovey that he's going to have to create new ranks for us. Uh, we're going to surpass A-star a star platinum and keep it moving. Um, but I promise you, we have not even broken the mold on the growth of what we're going to do with evolution. And you guys just have to either do two things, guys. Pay attention and recognize your, your possibilities and how far you can actually go. Or just stand by and watch it happen right before your eyes. So um, like Tony said before, guys, we truly appreciate you guys for chiming in every week. Um, you never know what you're going to get when you chime in, but just be very, very aware that this is the place you're supposed to be. This is the time you're supposed to be on there. And I always say to everybody on the line, guys, you do not have a team unless you encourage your team to know their place, where they should be, and how they should operate within the business, guys. Be the example. Uh, be the leadership, guys. Be the best you can be and actually show the world that you are a part of a business. You're not a closet agent. And you're really proud of what you've been able to achieve in this organization. Last but not least, before I jump off, guys, I'll turn it back over to you, Tony. Um, you guys have to realize that even though this is a $69 a month business, realize that, that at, at one point in time, it's going to be people making millions of dollars from a $69 fee monthly. So stop discounting your business, believing that you're only paying $69.95 and it's only uh, what you're actually paying and what it's costing you. And change your mindset to realize it's what can it make you. Think about that, guys. Not how much it costs you, but what can it make you. That's the bottom line, guys. So get focused. Get in drive. Get with your leadership. Find out what's next. Don't be a closet agent. And use communication as your best asset, guys, because that's how we get to the next level of the program. So, Tony, I'll turn around the line back over to you. I'm pretty sure we've been on the line kicking it pretty much long, and I know your training has been awesome. Um, but I'll turn the line back over to you. Thank you, Fred. Thank you, thank you. You guys, clap it up. 
that really is just so much it sums up it's everything in a nutshell you guys we just want you guys to truly understand how wonderful evolution travel has been to us um and how you can definitely incorporate it in your life to get whatever level of success you want to get but we like you said we don't want you to stand there and watch it happen we want you to be a part of the process so whatever it is get with your leadership um, get with your sponsor, get with us, and, and get that game plan together so that you can make that dream, you can make that vision, you can make that paper that you're going to put on your wall a reality. Make sure you meet it so that you'll have to pull it down, and like he said, get you a bigger piggy bank because your success goals will change, and we want to be here to help you get to that level where you want to be. So with that being said, you guys, get to a travel party near you. Here's the key. If there is no travel party near you, guess what? You can have one as close as your living room. Let your place be the place where people meet to learn about this wonderful business called Evolution Travel. Let, if you don't have a travel party near you, let your address be the travel party near you. Okay, let's make sure we are giving a thousand percent of our business to ourselves so that other people can feed off what we are growing um, and what we're doing and what we're experiencing. This is probably the most selfish thing you could do uh, would be to not share your business with somebody else. I know you know somebody who needs tax deductions. I know you know somebody who might have just um, need some extra money. Maybe they're early retired. Maybe they're off of work. Maybe they're looking for a job. Maybe they just ask you to borrow some money. I know you know somebody who loves to travel. I know you know somebody who knows somebody who loves to travel, right? There's nobody out there that's allergic to travel. Everybody wants to do it. Everybody deserves to do it. So with that being said, you guys, please don't be a closet agent. Make sure everybody knows that you're a travel agent. You have the ability, you have the professionalism, you have the keys and the tools to get anybody anywhere they want to go. And for that, Evolution Travel will give you commission um, and they will stay committed to your success and your dreams. You guys, this is Tony Ward on behalf hey, Tony. of Frederick hey, House. Yes, sir. Tony, have you gave out all the announcements for all the uh, events coming up? Absolutely. We did that in the beginning. Yeah. Okay, perfect, perfect. I hope everybody knows that there's a time and a place to be, but I hope everybody's registered for the 2020 convention, and I hope you guys will be at the birthday party. Those are going to be the two of the most major events. Um, I know we got Detroit popping. Tony War has, you know, the, the bay always on deck. Uh, I do believe we have an event in New Mexico on the 26th of October as well. Uh, so just, guys, pay attention to your local social media. Uh, go in the back office or reach out to your leadership to find out where you can actually be at. Um, and we're plotting and planning for 2020 to be the best. My bad, Tony. No problem. Yeah, I told them about the Evo schedule, so they'll all get an email tonight with all that stuff. It's all, Most of it's already there. I just need to add the, the meeting for Thursday for Detroit on there, and that's it. So, you guys, again, this is Tony Ward. On behalf of myself and Fred Howe and Raw Choices organization, you guys, we love you to the moon and back. Have a great rest of your Tuesday, and make sure – you are true to yourself, your business, and get that level of success accomplished. You guys have a good night. I'll see you at the bank and at the beach. This meeting is officially over. Bye, everybody.